be as I thought uh, there'd be. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to MVG Live. Tonight, we're playing Beyond Two Souls. Finally. Finally. We tried twice to play this game, and it had to be rescheduled twice. But genius. Uh, anyway, <clears throat> so there's two orders you can play this game in with this with this version. There's the order... You done, Bill? Yeah. There's the order that is intended for you to be played in by the developers, and there's the chronological order, or as, they, or as it's called here, the remixed order. We're going to be playing it the normal way because that's how it's intended to be played, but there it, it is a disjointed narrative, so it's going to jump back and forth uh, in the protagonist's life. So let's do it. Uh, yes. Let's do it. I can talk on the water, apparently. Yeah. I can make glowing debris circle my head. I can make sodomy faces and then still not hurt. That joke's not going to get old anytime soon. So in case anybody is confused, this is Ellen Page. And it's actually Ellen Page. Not just the voice, but the face too. Yeah, she did the mocap as well. Yeah. So, As did William we Defoe. just played L.A. Noir, which really kind of pioneered a version of facial uh, facial uh, capture software. This game is kind of the perfection of it. Yes. So where's Willem Dafoe? We'll get there. He takes a while we'll, from we'll, what I've heard. We'll get there. You guys can hear the game okay, yes? Little on the quiet side. Okay, how about now? That guy looks like, that guy looks like Mike Nelson, doesn't he? I guess it doesn't really matter because you've got the subtitles. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he does look a lot like Mike Nelson, doesn't he? I just noticed that. Where's Tom Servo? Her hair sure is short. What are you trying to look like Sigourney Weaver in Alien 3? Oh, God! Well, that, that, that was a bloody wall. Th thought that was coffee. It's like, where? There he is. Oh. There's yeah. William Defoe. Th there's old nickel bag face right there. How's it possible that William Defoe looks better in video game form than in real life? He doesn't look. He doesn't look like Skeletor in the video games. Exactly. I, he he should play Skeletor. Yeah, he, he was. I'm he to was follow. awesome in the Life Aquatic. He also should play the Joker. He uh -oh. wouldn't need much of any prosthetics. The SWAT team's here. This is some serious shit going down. Get the girl with the bald head. She did judo. Shoot her. <laughs> She's in the back room. She's getting ready to strip for me. Ew. That or she's eating vagina. Look. One of the two. Look, everybody's seen her tits and into the forest, okay? I believe this game was made before that. Uh, duh. Also, also, like, there's a way to hack it, uh, hack it, hack this game so you can see her naked in the shower scene. But I don't think it's her body. I think it's just one they put in there for modeling purposes. Oh, little girl. Would you like a cookie, little girl? <laughs> Wouldn't you have heard all of the people running in? Probably. Hi, Ashley. Officer Pedostash is waiting for you. <laughs> Where did the officer touch you? Did you do that, I picked... Oh. Um, he touched me right on my... By the way, I, I decided to play this game because we just played L.A. Noir, and this is going to be a little similar to that. 
Oh, load, wow. Some loads serious of ability. shit went down here. Yeah, apparently that SWAT team didn't work out too well. Well. You're too late, Willem. Oh, jeez. I came at just the wrong time. Wait a minute. So she killed all... So she took care of all the SWAT teams, but she didn't bother chucking super troopers over here. That's because they weren't trying to do shit to her. That guy was just following orders. The cop turns and he looks at him like, I, I told hope you're him gonna... not to say the Holocaust w wasn't real. I, I hope you're planning <laughs> on paying for all of this. So that was oh. the end of the that was the end of the first chapter. Wow, what a great game! Goodbye, everybody. Well, we're playing duck game <laughs> now. No, we're not doing that. <laughs> Ooh, those Guess what? Are, I'll hey, be able to... CRT monitors, holy shit. Again, the yeah. guy turns <clears throat> to Willem Dafoe and he's just like, I love so, you. Um, so that little girl is also Jody. I don't think it's Ellen Page, but it might be her face. Uh, oh, there you are. <laughs> no, that's so, not her face. So as I pointed out, as I pointed out before, this is a this game is a disjointed narrative, so that's why it gives you the option of playing it in the order it was intended to be played by the developers, and it was also uh, oh, Ghost Child, holy shit! And there's also an option to play it chronologically, which means you would have started here, I, uh, and not seen I, that end, that not seen that sequence. I imagine beginning. that cop was looking at Willem Dafoe like, "I loved you in Last Temptation of Christ." Let's get up. And my joke gets no sell. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> doodly, doodly, do. Doodly, right, doodly, I'm do. I'm sorry. I'll put the, I'll put the dolly down. Let me just walk around in a circle for a second. What's this? Tell me something good. Tell me. That's not the way, Jody. What, you want me to be dirty? I wanted to take a shower first, you fucking... Jody, Jody, do you know the way? Jody. That's a little Jody. racist since the dude's black. What's on the TV over here? What is this? Porn. Is that hard... Oh my god, is that hardcore porn? I don't know what this is. It's a cartoon of some kind. Oh my god, Snow White just turned into a chicken. <laughs> What the heck is this? Is this like Turkish Snow White? Oh my god. What is this shit? Billy, stop farting! That wasn't me! That was it's me. Squirrel. It's the adventures of Squirrel Girl. That was me, butt nuts. I still put the Bill Gas symbol. Alright, alright, I'll follow you, you fucking pervert. Oh, whoa, whoa. I wonder if this is the Department of Paranormal Investigations. I wonder if this is the Department of Redundancy Department. This is this. This is, isn't uh, Yes Minister. I would say it's Nambla, but that's not a point. Nambla, 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 Nambla. Excuse me one second. I need to turn the. I need to uh, make the font on the chat smaller. It's a little big. Just a little. You know, you know who that doctor looks like. He looks like fucking Yafet Kodo. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, I was in the movie Alien, bitch. Oh it god, was... I gotta run away from Dakota. Man, he was one of the first black. What? He was yeah, also one of the first Golden. black villains in Bond, too. I was in Golden. I was in Man with Golden. This is what the I thought he was. Like I thought it man. was. Um... Well, yeah, it was the ma no. It wasn't the Man with the Golden Gun. It was uh, yeah. Live and Let Die. That's probably the joke you were doing, and I will. And uh, I'm sorry. Do, 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 do. Thanks, Mark. Fucking thanks, Mark, you piece of shit. All right, going across the hall. Hurry, Jody. It's Make down it. here. <laughs> Hurry, Jody. Unzip my pants. Oh, come on now. Wow, there's a lot of blue here. Oh, another black guy. There's, a, there's an awful lot of minorities here. Jody. Affirmative oh God, action. another one. There's three in the hall. Run. <laughs> They're staring at me. 
I just imagine she's like incredibly racist. Like, look at all these blacks. Look at those. Bl- look nope, at these blacks. Ya. I'm gone. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm gonna go wreak havoc with my powers. Circle. <laughs> Wrong. Zap. <laughs> Hey, it's the scene from Ghostbusters. What I just did. All right, I'll sit down. I hope they're not as creepy as Vinkman it was. Then now this is gonna keep your mouth open. Well, no, never mind. <laughs> that was creepy. No, you your just, princess. That's <laughs> fat Albert? Yeah. He just has this look on her face like, what do you think, I'm for you fucking idiot? <laughs> I'm going to go jerk off in the other room. Hey, Jody, can you hear me? Jody, can you hear me? Yes, yeah, she can. Okay, let's start. <sighs> okay, let's start. Hi, I'm Kathleen. I'm a Sagittarius and I love my cats. It's so nice to see CR monitor, CRT monitors. Uh, go to any Goodwill and see them. Alright, I, oh, I, I have to switch to Aiden now. And go to the other room. Who was Aiden? Her ghost friend? Yeah, and I gotta see which card she picked. It was the star. The star. She picked star. Star. Let's go. Okay. Let's do it again. She has like she has her own Casper, basically. <laughs> A little more creepy than that. Square. Square. This one's got naked ladies on it. You like waffles? <laughs> Look at the vajayjee on this one. She's got the bacon card. Couple the of river. lazy lines. It's a bacon. It's bacon. <sighs> Let's try something else. How many of my testicles am I holding right now? All three of them. You're wrong. I only got two. Oh, crap. There's ghosts in here. Whoop. <laughs> uh, now the yeah. indicator is on her crotch. Oh, my Ooh. vagina. No. Oh. Oh. oh, Santa Maria. My gusto. Jesus. <laughs> it's Lisa Lampanelli. Ew, I got, loves Chachi. I got Willem Dafoe germs on me now. Do you like Chachi? Yeah. Sure. Okay. sure. Give me a kiss. Ha <laughs> ha. I hope that she doesn't cause him to become the, the uh... Idiot. No, I was gonna <laughs> say the uh, Green Goblin. 
and experiment. Joe you and somebody else play this game. Goodness, you've earned a whole bunch of achievements already. You see, Jody, nobody respects your authority. <laughs> Alright, my controller is charged, so let's get rid of the charge controller. The charging cord. For now. So now this is Jody in her early 20s. Dressed like a hooker. Apparently. In Saudi Arabia, looks like. <laughs> I feel like everybody's looking at us. Well, I mean, you look like you just got picked up off the street corner. And... Jody's like, there's a lot of sand people here. <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> <laughs> I knew you should have worn something else. Everybody's like popping fucking boners. Oh, God, I feel smell the rape in here. Oh, there's Saudis in here. She's probably they probably don't like how she looks. Yeah, there's a there's a lot of rape in there then. I didn't know you had a sense of humor. Brian, I'm delighted you could attend. Always a pleasure. Did you like some oil? I would like you to meet my assistant. Why is it she covered up? Jody's working for the uh, WWE. Uh -uh. I had I had to pull this over because I'm hiding a boner. Yeah, it's good. Wants the ripper. And now it's it's time for the Saudi uh, throat clearing dance. <laughs> Okay, so I gotta find a quiet place to make out with myself. I didn't mean to pick quiet. up the drink. Get drunk and then just expose yourself in front of all the Saudis and just be like, oh my god, it's nakedness. Oh no, it's Ellen Page's boobies. What am I supposed to do with this? She looks like a 12-year-old boy. <laughs> Actually, that makes me rock hard. Anyway, um... Where the hell are the bathrooms? Oh! The, those plants, because they poop in the plants. Oh. Oh, wow. This is right about Stop the, telling uh, me about my Wi-Fi connection, for fuck's sake. I don't care. This is... Certainly disjointed. Uh, this is the third chapter as we're playing it, but chronologically, it's actually the fourteenth chapter. Yeah. Wow, that's some um, disjointedism. Which is that? The which one's the men's room? Which one's oh my the god! Room? Oh my god! You know who plays Cole? Fucking Kadeem Hardison from from a different world. You, you know. Ooh, hi, lady. Who are you? I'm guessing this is the bathrooms. I guess nobody gives a shit that. I TV. don't. I never watched that show, so. What show? I did just go into the women's room. Okay, good. Hey, other white people. I'm safe. Where have I seen him from? Hala, 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 hala. Well, padded toilets? What the heck? A, uh, Jody, if you gotta take a shit, that's not exactly what you gotta do. Alright. Hey, they have toilet paper in there. They don't use toilet paper, they use their right hand. <laughs> oh my god. Is that the bitch from, from Inception? I, I don't know, are you ready? There's a large painting in one of the rooms upstairs. Behind it is a safe. The documents we're looking for are inside. But there are guards and cameras, so you have to be careful, you got it? Diablo yeah, Cody, I'm not doing a sequel. Leave me alone. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. If if Aiden is a is a spirit, how would the guards and the cameras see him? 
It could be the infrared or other things. Oh my I god, is he Jim? Run! <laughs> is somebody fuck a turkey? <laughs> hmm. I wonder which group she's working for. Who does number two work for? I show that turd who's boss. Okay, now so that movie's to go. 20 years old now. I know. I'll be right back, guys. I have to take my medicine. I need to go upstairs, though. There we go. This is definitely interesting. Aiden, what did you do? The iron sheet? Why does Ellen Page sound like she's ready to come? Osam, izhab walki nazra ala maktab al-safir. Hadir, sir. Izhab halan. Shit. The camera was on. The curtain's coming. Don't move anything or he'll sound the alarm. Okay. Here, check out this I found on the uh, wiki. What wiki? You have to... The wiki for the Beyond Two Souls. It's a picture of the mocap from the scene with the young child. Is that wiki? Them all... I'm guessing that wiki does not have the walkthrough. No, it doesn't. Okay. Well, it tells you what you can do, but it doesn't... This is a weird game. Yes, it is. I did not mean to go in there. Go back out. There we go. Ooh, you did a thing. I did a thing. There's the safe. I hope it's not alarmed. Bitch, who do you think you're talking to? Now we have to read the documents. Make it quick. I can't hold on much longer.
Oh no, her nose is starting to bleed. That darn cocaine habit. Well, this is definitely interesting. Yeah. Controller won't stop vibrating. So how old was Ellen Page when she did this? Other people have to poop. <laughs> was that so sorry? Um. So, um, yeah. Will you excuse me? I had to take a very large dump. Uh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh, I've been holding that in for three hours. <laughs> Farts. Oh, Jesus. Oh, that dump. Oh. <laughs> I forget oh. Ellen Page is Canadian. I should from Saskatchewan. That is the last... Uh, actually, Halifax, Nova Scotia. Oh, yeah, yeah, Nova Scotia. That's, That's the last right. time I ever eat Jimmy John's before a party. Oh, her wife's Canadian, too. Okay. I think we can leave. Wow. She looks haggard. Oh, Lord, too many claims. Drinking that alcohol beforehand. Ooh. She's drunk! Even though we put alcohol in every piece of her video. <laughs> You need to enter the alcohol. <laughs> I am Saddam Hussein, what are you doing? I am a turkey neck. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Alright, excellent. <clears throat> did you do the thing? I did the thing. I beat the embassy dragon. Now we're on to the party. Dragon. Now we're going to be teenage, Jody. That would be... Early 2000s? She's born in 1990, so... Yes. Yes. So she'd be... So this is probably 2005. Something I got. 2003, 2004. Five. How long has this how long has this game been in development? Uh well this game originally came out as the PlayStation Three in twenty thirteen and then this is a remastered edition that came out fairly recent uh a couple of years ago, like Oh, they even have his gap. Of course, it's literally uh let me see when this one came out. Yeah, so the original one came out in 2013, and this would have edition Mike's playing came out in 2015. Okay, bye, Willem Dafoe. Where's my movie career going? Oh, that's right, I haven't done really a good one since Juno, but that even sucked. Oh, wait, X Men. Oh, uh, well, the funny thing is, is that. He's actually done a lot of work with... Uh, no, 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 I'm talking about Ellen Page. Oh, uh... She's been doing stuff just... Hey, 
Oh, she was in Flatliners. Who is this girl? I forgot about. No, Ellen Page. Oh. Well, the remake of Flatliners. Yes. Oh yeah, that went well. That movie was just. Is that a real football game on TV? Sure, looks like it. I, I recognize the Chargers. Well, who are they playing? It's San Diego. Steelers. Who is it? I think it's Steelers. Are you sure? I see yellow pants. That looks more like uh, college football uh, to me. Yeah. I'd like to see what William Defoe's uh, being I up think to. that's Notre Dame. What the hell did the... Now, wait a minute. What the hell would the Chargers be doing playing Notre Dame? No, but it's college ball. Oh, is it college? Yeah, I believe so. Get close. See what... See what well, I, I will in a second. I gotta get the music going. Rock. Rock. Yeah, definitely. Apparently, William Defoe's favorite activity is doing laundry. Willem. William. William, sorry. No, Willem. William. Willem, yes, yes. Such a difficult name. Mr. Defoe, there. His favorite activity is la doing laundry. Why don't you just like the music then, you stupid bitch? You were so not interested in what I was doing. Wait, 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 wait. Let's... Oh. I can't see the TV from here. Okay, hold on. Now you can kind of see it. Yeah, that's college ball. Cut. I wanted to see the game. Is that Heineken? We should. Oh my god, let's play a makeout game. No. Sure, let's go. Underage drinking, yay! It's Bobby O'Doyle's. <laughs> O'Doyle's, you mean? Yeah, O'Doyle's. Looks like a Heineken. Actually, she probably has, knowing. Hmm. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's just have another one. Let's just open another one, even though we have an open one. God damn, <laughs> Jody. Found that oh, shit. Oh, alcoholic already. Oh, oh, I'm almost choked to death there. So let's actually... Let's... If I could... Like, see what game this is on the... Ah, fucking... The camera angle sucks. She's 14 years old here, so... Yeah. She's born in... 1990, 1990. that would make this 2004. When yeah. I graduated high school. If we could figure out what game that is on the TV, we could probably pinpoint the day. Well, it's if it's a college game, it's Saturday. it's an NFL game, which it doesn't look like yes, NFL sir. weather out there. Well, depending on what state they're in. Um, uh, sun, but I think this is a Saturday. If that's college ball, it's a Saturday. I've never seen you in school before, considering I'm 35. I'm in a different program. I'm gonna... Jody's the youngest. I'm making Jody be a little bit sociable here. Uh, let's see. I talk to ghosts and they obey me. So. I talked. So you have a British accent. That's pretty hot. <laughs> my my panties are soaked. Let's go to the bedroom. Even though you sound like Prince Harry's Down syndrome brother. Uh, Hello. <laughs> so uh, do you want do you want to make out? You want to kiss? Day, 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 day. It doesn't sound like that, you poopy <laughs> poop. <laughs> Who are you, Carl Sagan? Jesus Christ. Uh, I like dead pink. people. I'm just going to continue down the sociable path. 
Yeah, you don't want her to become like Mulder from the X-Files where nobody likes him. That's interesting. I'm gonna e be evasive. So is that a no on the making out thing? Depends on how drunk I get. Sure, you seem like a nice dude who's probably like f way too old for me. Jody's the youngest here. Uh, what's this guy's name? Oh, Nathan? You ever, so, you ever been penetrated? I actually don't know. Uh, let's see. This is either... This is Matt, I think. Yeah, this is Matt. How old is he? He is 17. Okay, well, I mean, technically he's in the okay, because they're both underage, but... And he's uh, born in London. <laughs> I don't know. I didn't know what he said, so I just went ironic. He said that you're very pretty. Um, Aiden's not gonna like that. You don't. You can't touch my butt, but you can kiss me. That's fine. It's okay. They're both underage. I mean, we it, shouldn't be uh, watching this, but they're both underage. Neither of them uh, are eighteen, which actually, in a weird, twisted way, makes it legal. Wow, it's so awesome making out with a girl I've only known for ten minutes. She's also just had two beers, so she's kind of wasted. Like, wait. Uh, well, it hey. seems like these people aren't hey. what they... Guys, guys, I'm totally not joking. Lee, come on, we, you just kissed me. Well, let's figure it out. Make the one have an orgasm. Uh. You just do it to my pins. I guess I just. All right. I'm guessing she's the one that you have to control. Wow, I'm reading about these teenagers in there. Fucking assholes. In my poom poom. I love one of the uh, trivia comments here. His hat is similar to that of Ash Ketchum for Pokemon for Steven's hat. wonder how far I can take this. Well, I'm I've... Killing them. Well, I'm not, you don't I'm kill not them. gonna kill them. You can set the house on fire. We'll get there. But I hope you don't choose that path. I hope you chose the path of where okay. you... That's enough. I gave you a demonstration. Walk out the door. Uh, that was cool, I guess? Ooh, you can get attacked by them. Oh, they want me to do it. Okay, well, alright. But didn't you just... Never mind. Because we're not watching football anymore. Can 
Yes. Hmm. Oh boy, this is going to end well. All right. Oh, oh dear. <laughs> well then. Oh yeah, that's 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 what friends give each other. Thongs. Sure, why not? Here's something you can stick up the crack of your ass. That's the gift that keeps on giving, I guess. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> Ooh. You just realized she has psychic powers and she could kill you. I let you kiss me, little bastard. Well, this just took a really bad turn. Alright, so here's what I'm going to ask you. So here's what I'm gonna ask you. Take revenge or let it go. Take revenge. Let it go. Let it go. Uh, I say take revenge. All right, two to one. Take revenge. You're gonna set the house on fire. Okay. Yep. Matt well, that's if you go far enough, anyways. Yeah. Matt wasn't such a douchebag. I would have said let it go. Oh, because you got an old book. Somebody gave me a book that was Edgar Allan Poe and was over a hundred and some years old. I'd be like, oh, cool. I gotta say, the fact that it, it, it went from fucking... I didn't have it. Just pretend it's your boyfriend. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. Damn it. I didn't see any other things.
Hello? Um, we're here. Oh my god. He chose the revenge path. Yeah, I, 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 I let it, I can't, brought it to a democratic vote. No, I know. I know. I was just saying, oh my god, because it's awesome. Who do you think did enough. that, you stupid ass? I think they've had enough. No. I don't think they have. You know, I'm sorry, but Mark ruined it for everybody. I mean, you're clearly getting revenge on them. Oh, she's dead. Oh, that's not gonna end well. The knives. Yeah, you can probably stab someone with them. Doesn't look like it. Aiden's lost control. Oh, I think I might download this game and give it a shot. I didn't burn it completely down and I didn't kill them. You can kill them? Probably. Uh, thanks for inviting me to your party. To be fair, they kind of brought it on themselves. Yes, uh, they did. Yeah. These, those are the type of people that bully somebody and then when the person gets back at them, you're a bully! Well, why did you do that to me? The, they're the type see. of people that punch you and then when you slug them in the face, they're like, well, Looks why did like you do that? Looks like I did with with the except for the showed your powers thing. Looks like they did. Uh, I did what most everybody did. There's a, mm -hmm. apparently a path I did not discover. Mm -hmm. That's all right. That was probably the one of choosing not to get revenge and just walking out the door. Fair enough. In any event, uh, next up is uh, first interview. Young Jody. I don't know how young. Oh yeah, young young Jody. Like we're back in the early stages again. Back in uh, the early She's about oh. eight here, I think. So ninety-eight then. Yeah, she's eight. So is it established that Aiden is the same age as her? Technically, or we don't know. We don't know. We we don't know, but I have read what he is, and it's definitely interesting. So this is uh, Jody's first meeting with uh, Willem Dafoe's character. Hello, Jody. It'd be cool if this department actually existed in real life. Uh, it's young Sheldon. Fanny. Fanny. She does. He. I don't. Does he do that much anymore now that she's living with, um, married and living to? Uh, nope. Nope. His character has evolved majorly. Sh Lord Sheldon's married now. He just got married in the season finale that aired like yesterday or the couple of days ago. Mark Hamill, uh, did the wedding. Yes. I'm sure he had fun with that. It was actually it was actually quite funny. Oh, 
also things that come out of my butt. You gotta see the weird thing that came out of my butt the other day. Yes. You're, you're fucking weird, Willem Dafoe. Shut up. It, it, it was in the shape of a screwdriver for some weird reason. Fucking Willem Dafoe! Shut your mouth! Should have seen the lug wrench that fell out the other day. W- Willem Dafoe. I, I, I swear to God. The other day I kicked a chicken in the face. Why I kicked a chicken, I don't know. Gave me a dirty look. Hell, I punched a donkey once for looking at me funny. Whoops. You want to see my collection of Hitler stamps? Excuse me? Joseph Hitler. He made hand cream. What'd you think I was talking about? No, I'm not indulging you, Willem Dafoe. I'm not indulging you. What happened to the subtitles? He hasn't said anything. He's just having Jody draw, I guess, Aiden? I'm not sure. Whoops. Have you ever eaten raw hamburger before? You ever seen a grown man naked before? <laughs> Apparently, Willem Dafoe says, I fucked a pineapple just to feel like a man, then I made a quiche. I licked the Pope's scrotum on a dare. Why does your friend look like a big ball of poop? Cost a lot of money, you little brat. To foeisms. Pardon, pardon me a second, because I want to go back and make sure I'm synced. Look at the th- selection. I was thinking that the audio sync was off, but maybe it's not. Take it down to like 600, maybe? You don't have any themes downloaded? Shh. Okay, that'll work. No, I don't. Actually, I think that what I have on there is technically a theme. There we go. Now it seems like the lips are synced up. Oh, yeah. Ooh. I don't care about the Wi-Fi. Fuck off with that. <laughs> Somebody tell my Wi-Fi to fuck off. The monster is meeting my mother. For the very first time. There we go. She okay. drinks. So it looks like I went with most people on this one. Let's move along. Next is, uh, welcome to the CIA. Sixth chapter in the game. Uh, and this is... This is a tutorial level, basically. Mm. How to fight. How to fight and everything. Oh, so she does work for the CIA. Yes. That's who, why she was in the Middle East. With that previous one. Yes. She still looks 12. Uh, I would say well, she's in her mid twenties here. Uh, it says here that it happens between eighteen to twenty. Okay, so we're talking. This is probably, let's see, two thousand eight or nine. In other words, uh, 
Ah, they cut right. her hair. Yeah. Yep. CIA, tre they're treated just like the military. Yes. Well, that's because quite often they can be embedded with the military, so... Oh, yeah. I once there. just bagged the mayor's birthday cake. And I invited a homeless person to my apartment to eat the key stuff. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you stupid idiot. Oh, great. Now she's going to do Juno. Find your grip. Use your momentum to swing across. Hurry! Jump on the Hydra's back! Oh, I gotta, like, physically move the controller down. Shut up, little Asian man. Shut up, Wang Chong. Hmm. Hi, yeah. Did the police just hit me? So, this is how we fight in the game. We just gotta follow the movements it's saying. Yeah. With the right stick, yeah. that is. Yeah. Gee, they actually used real physics. She didn't knock him clear across the room. Good job. Oh no. That's because they do all the bullshit stuff with the Aiden. Everything else is actual. You kind of wonder if the CIA has people Whoops. that kind of are like this. It it's hard to say. It'd be like that movie, The Men Who Stare at Goats. Yes. Though that wasn't the CIA, that was the that was actually an army development program. Should Based on mm -hmm. Well, we covered it in a dartboard and I actually read the book that the movie is based on. Some oh, wow. Wow. The uh <laughs> book was the book uh certainly had some interesting shit going on. Wow, yo, you read a book. What, you think you're better than me? Don't make him answer it. Don't make him answer it. Maybe. Good. Good. My name's Lawrence. We gonna play tennis? End of the K equals down, apparently. Okay, I'm already lost. This is just letters to me. Yeah. yeah. This is this is math. There was one number in that whole thing and that was math. Okay, Alright. Whatever you say. How about I just get rid of you? Poof. Kapoof. And kapoof. And kapoof. And kapoof. 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 And kapoof. 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 Like, you don't <clears throat> judge me on this, you don't even have powers. <laughs> Actually sparring now? Alright. Looks like, uh... Did a like, flea just hit me? Looks like Kevin James is out of work again. They cancelled Kevin Can Lee. I saw that. Oh, wow, already? Well, two seasons. I mean, it was literally turning into King of Queens 2.0. Well, that's because they've killed his original wife off and uh, brought in his wife from the well, uh, King of Queens. She died. I mean, it's like she got killed or something. Did you just say keep your fat ass down? Yes. Her ass isn't that fat. She's a fucking stick figure.
You gonna play tennis? And up. And scale this fucking wall. You're a fucking Sunday stroll. Oh God! I'd like to see you do this again. I only had to do it once. Get up over that goddamn up. wall! Come on, Jody. There we go. Good job. I broke my ankle. Oh, R two. L two. Ow, my vagina! Oh, God. <laughs> well, I just broke my hymen. Maintain two the two orbs to wound Jody. Or heal Jody. <laughs> yes, let's Good kill Jody complete. with Aiden. Aiden would literally be committing suicide if that happened. Yes. Oh, whoops. <laughs> that's, that's such like real life. I can't do push-ups in real life either. That's sit-ups. <laughs> See? <laughs> Was I wrong? <laughs> what the fucking rapidly tap the bumpers? That's weird. All right. Come at me, bro. Fighting them both. Oh, weapon, eh? Oh, I'm going to hit you with stick. Come here. Proving she can handle herself in two-on-one -on combat. Yes. And so far, so good. Come on, come on, come on. Tap. Not bad. Not bad? She just whipped those two guys' ass. In real life, you should grab the stick and just start jamming it down his throat. Apparently Willem Dafoe's doing cock push-ups or something. When I see my strength... Eh, eh, eh. Jeez. Alrighty. I'm being paged. I'll be right back. <sighs> well, Did we go play dinner. We've been doing this for an hour now. That's why vaginas are prayer. Mike got okay. called up to the front. He did? I never heard that. Yep. Uh, I'm used to people no-selling me and ignoring me. It's okay. Uh, I was telling you, he got called up to the front. I mean, I, 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 I do nothing but offer my friendship and my love, but, you know, you know whatever. And that's why vaginas are friends. Hmm. Yeah. The red if this was blue of the warmest colors, would you be trying to get the vaginas to kiss? Looks like, uh... Looks why? Like, looks like the Eurovision 2018 was won by Israel. Oh, wow. wow. Really? But they're not even a European country. Okay. I know they did get invited, as did Australia. And then the Chinese network that was broadcasting the show got booted by the Eurovision because they were censoring material. 
good times. The last time they won it was in 1998. Israel. Really? Hmm. Yeah. Finland won it once. Hey, Finland won against Canada in the that was, world. Uh, that was Lordy, right? Yeah. It was the first time a metal band had ever been on uh, Eurovision. And they won it. <laughs> Does happen. Well, they outshined everybody that was there. I mean. Well, yeah. Well, they're an interesting. Uh, Eurovision's an interesting thing. Well, I mean. What is the point of Eurovision? Like, is it just countries making up songs and sending representatives? I think it's supposed to do, like, Unity of Europe or some shit like that. They asked Lordy, would you ever do Eurovision again? They're like, no. <laughs> Fuck that shit. Ah. Uh, it says right here, as war-torn Europe was rebuilding itself in the 1950s, the European Broadcasting Union, based in Switzerland, decided to create a thing and it led to Eurovision. So it's to help promote the peace of Europe. Mm. And then I'm doing a very good job. No. I mean, fucking Azerbaijan won in 2011. It's true. Look at that. The year that Lordy won, there was this band from Trinidad that came in dead last, and they were all butthurt about it. Apparently, the next one's in Jerusalem. Is 2019 Eurovision. Oh, shit. Trump will be ecstatic about that. It's great, babe. Bill, Trinidad, I don't think, was in the... Uh, in it. Isn't Trinidad in the... Uh, Caribbean? What was the... I can't remember. Here, what year was it? I can probably the find Lordy. it. There was this band, they were all they were all butt hurt. That Lordy won. And they were making fun of him on a talk show. Alexi Lordy. Oh Lordy, 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 Lordy. What the hell? With an eye. According to this, uh... Oh, that would have been 2006. Uh, the last placed team in 2006 was from... Oh, uh, Monaco. Oh, sorry, no. No, no, sorry. Uh, Andorra. A N D O R R A. Where the hell is that? Oh, it's one of the principal. Yeah. There was a principal. Holy shit, that's a small area. Seventy-seven thousand people. Four hundred and sixty. 467 kilometers squared. Micro country. Yes, they finished dead last. They had eight points with their song Sense 2. H. Kabibble, Kabibble. They're from Rand McNally. Yugoslavian suplex. Kind of wonder what that would look like if that was an actual move. First, you grab them by groin. 
Then, then you spin them around and then flap them on their face. Then you lick them. Let's see who finished dead last in the uh, dead last. Dead last. In, dead last. In, in in this one in the. Uh, the new so, one. Yeah, so the Iceland looked like in the first round semifinals had the lowest. Then, oh wow, fairly good. Okay, so the person with the least in the finals was... Your mom. No, I'm just kidding. Of a group from Portugal. <laughs> oh wow, that's kind of sad. The team from Portugal that was hosting it finished dead last, or the singer did. Ouch. Oof. You gonna play team? Of course, the uh, UK didn't exactly do well either. Oh, who was the band from the UK? Uh, Sue Ree? Probably some hipster band. That's a woman. Probably some hipster woman. Apparently, she graduated from the Royal Academy of Music. Hipster. Hmm. Her song was called Storm. Hmm. Katrina and the Waves won Eurovision one year? I saw that ABBA did one year. I don't even know who Katrina and the Waves are. They were... They were... They, they're the guys who sang Walking on Sunshine. <laughs> really? Walking on. Oh yeah, ninety-seven. Strange. It's definitely some interesting people in here. Yeah, Apple won in nineteen seventy-four. Waterloo. You don't care that you. That, uh, okay. He's been gone that long. Yeah, his controller disconnected. How long has he been gone? Oh, about 17 minutes. Ooh, that's not good. No. When did his mom get back? His mom today. Oh, just today? Mm hmm. Oh, like buddy. two hours before the start of the stream. Oh, buddy. Oh, baby. Banana. Hmm. Eurovision.
Yeah, there's some straight. I think there was a. Was it a cross dresser or a guy who was transitioning one year? Who? It was just a woman with a beard. I couldn't recall correctly. It was a woman with a beard. So they had Ukraine, Spain, Slovenia, Lithuania, Austria, Estonia, Norway, Portugal, UK there, as well as Serbia, Germany, Albania, France, the Czech Republic, Denmark, Australia, Finland, Bulgaria, Moldova, Sweden, Hungary, Israel, Netherlands, England, or sorry, Ireland, Cyprus, and Italy. In a partridge in a pear tree. Then they have Romania, Bucharest, and Svitfania. And there was only one person. That was from Latveria. Doom! Supreme Leader Victor Van Doom. Just imagine what his Eurovision song would be. If you don't let me win, I will kill all of you. He wins, everyone! <laughs> oh. What is the name all of the, the judges are a Doom bot. What is the name of the country that he rules? Latveria. Latveria, Latveria wins Eurovision. Fifty years in a uh, forty-five years in a row. Why is he not dead yet? I'm immortal. I'm a comic book character. Oh, that explains it. There were people that actually thought Latveria was a real country. I'm like, no, Stanley made it up. <laughs> yeah, they they made it up. They wanted it to be vaguely Eastern European, but I'm not back. be evil. Welcome Hi. back. Sorry, it took so long. Hey. And they wanted a country that sounded Eastern European, but wasn't actually real with Latveria. It sounds like a real country, though. Oh, it sure <laughs> does. I mean, you would think you're like, is that a real country? Then you look at it, you're like, oh, it's not. <laughs> but God, it sounds real. I mean, it just sounds like a real country. It sounds more realistic than Wakanda. <laughs> well, yes. Wakanda forever. Hell, Latveria. Latveria, land of the rising sun. Because I said it is. <laughs> The sun doesn't rise there. If I say it does, it does. Long live doom. He's my favorite supervillain in Marvel. Yeah, well, he's a, he, he's, he is a villain, but when the stakes are high and it actually is important to, you know, actually save the Earth and do other shit like that, he's totally 100% willing to help <laughs> mm -hmm. because he he doesn't he doesn't want to destroy the world he wants to rule the world there's and, a there's, and Stanley brought this up you know since he's you know the ruler of his own country he has diplomatic immunity all right so he can't go to prison but what he says he wants to do is not against the law He if does have typical immunity. Well, think about this. If if you were the jaywalk, you know, in front of a cop, he gave you a ticket. You know? Now, if you walked up to a cop and say, I want to rule the world, can't do nothing against it. There's no law against that. And that's what he wants to do. 
So he can't get arrested for wanting to rule the world. Thank you, sir. He never gets to, but, you know. Well, yeah, there are, uh, like, there's been times where he's... You know, <gasps> actually done the right thing, and everybody's shocked. And he's like, "I do have my moments," and they're like, "Fair enough." Except during uh, Secret Wars. Well, that entire storyline is an abomination. Hey, hey, hey! I love Secret Wars. I don't know. I just didn't like the fact that Fury Blaine watched a whole bunch of heroes to invade that area. It's just. No, oh, you're thinking of the old, the new Secret Wars. I'm talking like 80s. Yeah, no, I was talking about the 2004 one. No, oh, the, no. Oh, 80s one's fine. That's the one I'm talking about. Not that one. Not that Secret Wars. No, that's, that's a piece of crap. I'm talking the original Secret Wars. And Lord, even Secret Wars 2 is better than... The one from the one you're talking about. But yeah, Secret Wars, I, uh, I, I'd, I'd love for them to make that into a movie. It, it would just be so good. I mean, as soon as Disney has control of Fox, you know, productions, that movie can be greenlit. You know, because you need the X Men and you need the Fantastic Four. Yeah. I mean, they they have control of Spider Man somewhat. Well, uh, they, they 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 he they they have control of Spider Man per se, but his parts of his rogue gallery they don't. All right. Well, they won't really need it for this because not really it, other than the lizard. That's, oh, well, they've Doc used the lizard, like, twice, so... Dr. Octopus. I mean, but for the most part, on the other side, you need... You need the Fantastic Four, the X-Men, and you need Captain America, uh, Spider-Man. Uh, the only problem is they... I have a feeling it might have to be a Bucky Barnes cap version of Captain America. Eh, true. Uh, Hawkeye. Yes. Um, Polaris. Hmm. Uh, they'd have to figure out a way to introduce the characters without it being stupid. Well, I mean, Polaris is, uh... It would be a good Excellent. way to introduce her. It, well, not, not that Polaris. Uh, uh, Pulsar? Or whatever her name is? I can never remember. There's so you, many characters. You, you that... know, you know who I'm talking about—the black lady in the white suit. I vaguely remember, but it's been a while. Oh, oh, that doesn't look good. Oh, they're waiting for her on the train. <clears throat> Although at that time, during uh -oh. that time in Secret Wars, she was Captain Marvel. Yes. Well. I wonder now that they're going to be doing a Captain Marvel uh, movie if they'll introduce Marvel Girl, the current version, or Miss Marvel, I should say. Mm, I don't know. She, they're actually they're they're really, really, really uh, gambling with this one coming up. Captain Ama Captain Marvel. Yeah. They're gambling with this one. Oh, well, I mean, we thought the same thing with uh, Doctor Strange. Doctor At Strange. I... Doctor Strange is actually more well known than this version of Captain Marvel. It really, it really is. Uh, for the most part, uh, I mean, she's not that popular. Marvel likes to make it out like she's like over popular, but she's not. Uh, yeah, and and for the most part, I everybody you know I've asked like, how many think of them? Like, they're like they're making a movie of that crap comic book. Well, <laughs> she's not like she's not liked either. Well, 
I think you also have to remember that there's the uh, uh, fact when Which, she was Miss Marvel. Marvel, and then Which, she switched over to Captain Marvel uh, around 2011-ish. People really... It, it's the writer's faults that have gotten control of the character. Because when she was... Whoever was doing the Miss Marvel comics, she the, the, she was likable. But uh, now they just... I guess we'll have to find out and see how it does. No, I'm sorry. We can't do anything for you. Hell on the floor. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. No, I'm gonna get on the train. Get on the train. And shut my door. Oh, no, no, turn that on. I'll turn the light off. Uh, turn my fan off. I'm like... You turned my oh. fan off. I'm very disappointed in you. I like to keep the air circulating in my room. Uncle Billy, Uncle Billy, don't be disappointed on me. I'm sorry, you've disappointed me by turning the fan on. Oh no, I wanted the fan on. I know, I was just making a joke. Well, it fell Sorry. flat. Flatter than a pancake. Well, I mean, that's what happens with my stuff. You guys should know that by now. That is true. I'll have you know that most of my jokes are have what contributed to the New Day's pancakes. Well, she certainly has the training to kick the shit out of a bunch of People sheriff's want, deputies. Yeah. Well, yeah, a lot of sheriff's deputies are like, you want this job? Yeah, here you go. Well, unlike here in Canada, uh, sheriffs in Canada aren't a... Uh, well, sheriffs in Canada are only deal with criminal court stuff, and the rest actually deal with... Uh, uh, and then police up here, you have to have a minimum of a four-year degree in uh, criminology to even think of uh, applying to do the police training up here. Here, it all depends. Usually, a lot of these... Cops the sheriff's don't... ones don't tend to have as stringent requirements, but the big city uh, ones do. Well, if it's a small little town, it's pretty much... You run for election in the town. Yeah. And you become sheriff. Yes. That's that, pretty much it. That doesn't um, happen up here. Well, now, that's only in the very, very small podunk towns. Yes. Now, when you're talking, like, area where I live... You'd actually you gotta, have a professional you, you, police force. Yes, you have to go through the academy. Yeah. You have to be trained, which but is... But there's also a lot of areas that are sheriff air, sheriff areas. Oh, they and, do make up a fairly decent size of areas in the states. And to be a county sheriff... Um, you got to go through board training. Yeah. And to and the, but the one guys you have to worry about here is the highway state patrol. Yes. They are scary. <laughs> but yeah, in, up here, before you even get into police training, you have to have a minimum of four year criminology, degree. either a two year or a four year. But I think most of them want four year criminology degree. So you actually have to yeah. go to university first to have that criminology degree before they you even can think of applying for the my, academies. My, my brother has that. He is he's a sheriff and he has four year degree in criminology. Yeah. Um, most sheriffs here do too. Yeah. Well, and that's also, that helps to, uh, a lot of that helps to do, uh, alleviate, when they have those degrees, it does help to alleviate a lot of issues because they have the educational background to know what they're doing instead of just running for office, like, 
running for the office and becoming the sheriff and then and appointing even, whoever even, they want. Even the deputies here have to have that. Mm -hmm. That's a requirement. Either you go to a college or you do it through the academy. Mm -hmm. For a couple of years, you'll be the low man on the totem pole. You'll just be doing office work. That's how they do it here. Oh, yeah. I mean, you kind of saw that with uh, Cole, actually, with uh, L.A. Noir. He started... Uh, he started the beat and then eventually got up to uh, up to the uh, detective. You gotta go to do a detective's exam. Yes. Oh, jeez. And it is not easy. Well, of course not. I mean, gotta beat detective. Up. Oh, don't hurt the dog. I have They're to. They're doing... attacking me. They're just doing their job, but she has to. God, thank God they're not Rottweilers, or she'd be dead. <laughs> no, they're just German Shepherds. I know. It's a good thing they're not Rottweilers. Oh, oh, I hope you off. don't kill a dog here. You gotta, you gotta. She scared them off. He, Aiden scared Aiden's, them off. Aiden scared them off. Now summon a bear to do your bidding. I'm limping away. Great. Yeah, well, that dog bit you in the leg. The great Where the hell am I supposed coaster. to go? You're supposed to go to the uh, Tibet and find the ancient one. Is that your mantra? No, it's the Wi Fi password. We're not completely hopeless out here. Oh. Oh, oh. Sorry, that's one of my funnier lines I found in Doctor Strange. It, it, it is a funny line, isn't it? Where the hell am I it supposed is. to go? It, it so sums up how they're blending, the blending together of technology and magic in the Doctor Strange, that line. This is just crazy. She's on the run. Shoot her in the butt. What numbers are you talking about? You gonna play tennis? Have a good night, Dane. Did you just kill the sh police officer? No, he's unconscious. Uh, gee, if you play this in order, you can get better context about everything. Well, I know, but it's meant to be completely out of context. As you learn what the hell has been happening to her. I have this in my library. So now, because I did that, I can download it anytime for free. As long as you have PlayStation Plus. Yep. Yep. I gotta hold down R2. Get your motor running, bam, 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 bam. get up on the highway, looking for adventure. Well, I suck on four wheels, so hopefully two will be a little bit better. Oh, whatever comes our way, 
It's a lesbian on a bike, yeah. <laughs> it's a lesbian on a bike. Well, to be Don't fair, be lesbians, yeah. To be They're fair, on the bike. The it's actress might be, but the bike. the person in the game isn't. I know. It's just, it's a joke. It's a joke. It's not a good one, but it's just, it's, it's a joke. I could have did the. I could have said what rhymes with bike, but I chose not to. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Police okay. barricade. Isn't that a bit expensive? She a superhero. Wow, that's a long reply. Yep. And it's all up on the stream, too, for prosperity's sake. <coughs> Shit. Wow. Assholes. Oh shit. Yeah, we going to play tip now. Oh, you do it. I'm sick of you. I just possessed this guy. Cool. Huh. I didn't blast that car. Possessing you now. Well, that guy's dead. Yes, well, they're messing with somebody who has incredible paranoia. Par paranoia powers. Yeah, paranoia. Par par <laughs> they have incredible paranoia <laughs> powers. Oh, God, they're going to get me. Run. <laughs> Incredible paranormal powers. Go this way. <laughs> nah, they're paranormal. They're, they're per to per to per to. Paranoia powers. <laughs> um. 
the paranoia powers. They're the, uh... I'm wanna go up doing a what I can, Jody. Just calm your tits. Certainly are being destructive. I'm trying to get this fucking truck, but... Because I can't no more. What else do I do? I can't do that. Go up there. Oh. Possess no. him. Okay, you're possessed. Down you go. Jeez. Okay, what happened? There we go. Oh, shit. Wait a minute. No. Go back up there. Let's go back up here and completely Oh god damn it no Go back up here Okay, what else do we got? Let's go this way. You're possessed. Oh, they're fucked. There's gas over there. Oh, that's not good. Oh, I think she is going to get you. My God, my God. My God. I didn't quit. Create a diversion. Blast the cars. What will we do now? I've been everywhere, man. Really? You have? Well, no, I was just thinking about her. Wow. Ooh, she switched a guy. Certainly he's wrecked shit. Hold on, I gotta figure out what I'm supposed to do. Oh! I see. <laughs> Alright, well, helicopter pilot is gonna die. See ya. She's destroyed a. Uh, that's probably. That's a. If that's a Huey. Black. Hawk. Let's see how much she just cost the government.
That's a Black Hawk. She just cost the government about $21 million. Now give me a kiss. I would certainly hope they get the message. So what, uh, what chapter is that in the chronological? Uh, that was towards the hunt, hunted. I would imagine that was all. That would. I think that might be the last chapter. No, it's not. Probably pretty close though. She's only twenty-one in this, and the oldest she gets is twenty-four. Because the epilogue date year twenty five. Oh, okay. So, which would make it twenty fifteen. <coughs> You're back in the. Past yeah, we're going. Again. To, uh, we're back in the early nineties or the mid nineties. Maybe the late nineties. I might even see. Oh God! Five Nights at Freddy's. It's the uh, ghosts that aren't actually ghosts, but are connected to her power, I believe. It's like, oh, you kooky kid. I sure as fuck can spend the whole day looking out the window. I believe this is called My Imaginary Friend. Yes. This takes place when she's eight, which is... Uh, here's the trivia for this. After some working out, it can be deducted that this chapter takes place in 1999. Okay. Late 90s it is, then. Literally the last decade of the last year of the... Of the decade, of the millennia, of, as it were. Of the 1990s, yes. I wonder how much fear of Y2K there is. Oh, Lord, there's so much greed. So much greed, yes. Can you take me higher? I'm living in a car. <laughs> I thought you were going to say I'm living in a cardboard box. I'm living in a box. Living in a cardboard box. Okery dokery. Killy, don't killy. And now they scissor.
Pardon me, I think I'm being paged again. All right. I'm living in a box. I'm living in a cardboard box. And I'm living in a van down by the river. Living in a van down by the river, living in a van down by the river. Yeah, I, uh... Rivers are nice until they flood, like what's happening up here. Because, you know, our 120% of snowpack is melting because we had, like, 25 degrees Celsius weather th this week. Mm -hmm. All right, did you hear the, the wildfires that happened? What caused the wildfires? Where? They, they were having uh, in, uh, God, I think it's Nova Scotia? Or in, in Canada. They, they, had, they, were, they were burning some, like, uh, you know, the controlled fires that they do. Mm-hmm. And a rabbit caught on fire. And spread the flames? And it spread the flames. Because it ran and it was on fire and it spread the flames. And of course, it's dead now, but you know. But yeah, Charming. That's, what happened. that's what happened. It's like. <laughs> like, you can't blame a cigarette for that. <laughs> Excuse me. You're excused. Thank you. So I wonder in what inedible way the government's fucked up in this game that leads to some situation. I don't know. <clears throat> Probably pretty high. Getting tired. That's why I'm against the MetaHuman uh, Registration Act. Yes. They did get a, rid of that eventually in Marvel Comics. Or did they bring it back? They tried to. Of course they did. And guess what character wanted to do it again? Tony Stark? Yeah. No, Miss Marvel, or Captain Marvel. I see. Because she's a cunt. <laughs> Tony's trying to tell her, like, oh, it worked so good the first time. Let's try it again. Yeah, well, I mean, he. The nice thing is he completely forgot that it it was his fault that he did it when he had the memory wipe and they sent him back to a date previous to when the civil war happened the uh mm -hmm. in the early in the mid 2000s when they uh when uh thor's asgard was floating over a town in what was it kansas no no i don't know it wasn't iowa was it Ar missouri was it missouri yeah it was some middle state yeah, because his, his mind got reset to a previous thing because it was the closest update he had, and he was looking through, and he was like, oh, shit, I did that. Oh. 
Well, um, um, whoops. Yeah, got to do it again. He's like, oh, yeah, sh-. when he got his memory back and he did, he's like, oh, yeah, it worked so good the first time he tried to do it. Yeah, which is not at all. But Miss Marvel, uh, Kez, this, the, the, how the writer's writer, she has this mentality like that basically it's I'm a woman so I'm always right <laughs> seriously I'll be a writer and I know I'm talking about a fictional character but it's a poorly written fictional character I did like how she was written in the Miss Marvel days yeah as in everybody they made her likable she was a strong character and they didn't try to make her... Had to shave her... her legs a lot with that costume. True. I mean, they make a joke about it in uh, during the time when Norman Osborn uh, created Hammer. Uh-huh. I remember they... that. Yeah, they made a joke about her replacement joke about shaving all the time because of the leotard. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Oh, excuse me. Again, man. It's the egg for young I ate. That's what you get for eating out with Chinese. Uh, I like Chinese food. I was making a multi-layer joke there. I, I know. I, I do love the Chinese. <laughs> In more ways than one. Yep. He's turning Chinese now. He really thinks so. <laughs> do, 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 do. I think I'm turning Chinese. Because uh-huh. you wanted to in you wanted to create a Imperial dynasty that would only last 300 years and then a new government would have to be formed. Because uh-huh. if you look at it, for the most part, the average length of the Chinese imperial governments was like 300, 400 years at the most. There's a yeah. few that were, there was the few that were longer, but a lot of them were either that, 300, or much less throughout Chinese history. Japanese less than longer. Well, the Japanese the reason they did is because they had a single they they started as a single imperial a, a single uh, force from the unif- from from the start there wasn't various groups that had to be uh, had to, so it evolved over time where in Japan where it was much easier to control especially with it being an island compared to you know how big China, China is the, China the second biggest country in the world it goes Russia China Brazil mm, I believe not it's a, size size it's actually Canada Canada second yeah it's Russia Canada China and then the United States Brazil's fifth because, yeah, Russia is 17 million square kilometer, so, kilometers so square. So, so what's the fourth? United States, 9 oh, United million. States. Brazil's 8 million. So, uh, miles. Uh, and it's in kilometers squared. Because, you know, everybody else uses kilometers. But, so. but uh, population-wise, China's got its beat. <laughs> yes, India's the seventh largest land size yes yeah, Saudi Arabia which is pretty big 13th the tiniest is actually Vatican City at 0.44 squared kilometers it's about as big as my town you know, actually it's smaller than my town <laughs> it's a micro nation but it's 
it they somewhat recognize it as its own country, but it is, it is, and it isn't. Yeah, it's a sovereign state. They have their own rules within the walls. Yeah, it's its own sovereign state, but it's like it's only a hundred and ten acres. Yeah, it's not very but, big. Yeah, it's Lichtenst- it's Liechtenstein is bigger than that. Not by much. Liechtenstein's one hundred and sixty kilometers squared. It's pretty small too. And then you look at like say Singapore, it's a little less than seven hundred. It's about six hundred and ninety two kilometers squared and there's like an insane amount of people in Singapore. Yeah, there's hey, five million. But hey, Liechtenstein is economical. You can't <laughs> They got a, from what I heard, their economy is pretty good. Uh, from them being so small. Yes, it's it's because it was used as a tax haven for a long time. Mhm. But that's kind of not like that anymore. <sighs> Let's see. I don't. I don't even know what language they speak there. Probably German. In Liechtenstein, yeah, it's German. It's the sixth smallest country in the world. What's the smallest? Vatican. Oh. Then Monaco is the next smallest at uh, one point uh, one point nine five kilometers squared. And then the next biggest one, the 194th smallest, is uh, only 21 square kilometers, and it's a island nation in the Pacific. Well, of course, islands are going to be small. Guam is tiny. Yes. Well, Guam... Guam is 210 square miles or 540 kilometers squared. Now, if you put that into perspective on the island that I live in, my island is 12,000 square miles or 31,285 kilometers squared. Okay, so your island is 12,000 square miles. Yes. It's so not. You're, you're bigger than Guam. Uh, we're like the twelfth largest island in the world. Japan being the largest. No, wait, no. No, Japan is. <laughs> no. Oh, sorry, Vancouver Australia. Islands. Sorry, Vancouver Islands, the forty-third largest island in the world, but it's Canada's eleventh largest. Australia would be considered an island. It's a continental landmass, so yes. But actually, the biggest island is Greenland. What's considered, uh, it's Australia's with it with Australia being considered a continental landmass. It doesn't quite count, but Greenland is two point one kilometers squared, or eight hundred and twenty-two thousand square miles. Uh, to put that into perspective, Japan is the seventh largest island in the world. It's at uh, 225,000 square kilometers or 83,000 miles. I think think the people that were designating that were were from Greenland and they're like, we want ours to be bigger. They're a continent. (laughs) That's what we're going to do. They're going to be a continent. And they're not going to be considered an island. Continental landmass, actually, and this is actually by experts and other things. I know but it's 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 a joke. Do you want to know what the smallest island is? What is it? It's called the Smaley Islands. It's uh, three hundred and ninety square miles. 
It's in Antarctica. Ah. Nobody lives there. Just penguins. Yeah. Could you really count it? <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh, hello, Hanya. Why? Well, she's going to be some island out in the Pacific and, like, two people live there and they're like, hello. <laughs> I know one of the keys, one of the Florida keys, there's like seven houses on one of them. Huh. And uh, you have to, the only way you can get there is on boat. Yeah, my island is actually, uh, it's the largest Pacific island anywhere east of New Zealand. And you got Bigfoot on your island. Yes. It's always hard to see. He got a lot of woods. Oh yeah, like if he lived in the northern part, of most the the population of uh, the population of the, of of my island is like seven hundred seventy five thousand, give or take. Uh, since this is twenty sixteen, uh, two years ago, census, but so there's a lot of territory on the north part of the island where it's just. Nothing. Woods and woods, woods and, unpo- and woods and woods. Yeah. Unpopulated. Oh yeah, like the most of the uh, northern, most of the population mass actually uh, is on in the, the southern. Coast. No, well on the coast, but in the southern section of the island. So my city, my area down is where most of the population is. Like most of it's in Greater Victoria, and then you have pockets of like my city, which is about a hundred thousand, and then. Uh, it, and then Campbell River has about 35, 20 to 35, and then it's small of all the rest of the up island. Mm. But yeah, and the roads can be quite dangerous at times, too. Hmm. One of the hazards of uh, laying on an island. Well, you have to understand that in the southern part of the island, where uh, Greater Victoria is, is there's a there's a mountain pass. Oh yeah, I forgot you got a, you have mountains on your island. Yeah, well, it's only like a thousand feet, the Malahat, but uh, during the winter, it can it can uh, freeze and snow, and you can, it can cut off the north part of the island from the south part of the island for a while. I think we're going to be ending soon. Well, you bet we'll. I, I we'll probably end when Mike comes back. I would assume so, given that it's now nine thirteen. Mm-hmm. But yeah, the Malahat's actually very dangerous. There's a lot of people who have passed away on it. Yeah, because Bigfoot eats them. No, it's because the road's so dangerous because it's gets really narrow because it literally was cut through a mountain which was the only area where they could go that's what they want you to think but really it's Bigfoot eating them this is an old goat it's the old uh, goat path yeah, you go down there and there's like 40 of them standing there waiting for you and then they eat you huh <laughs> go on the other side you're like oh this is bah! I'm actually looking at the place where I'm going to the convention at in June on the Google Maps right now. It's full of Bigfoot. See, I live in an area where there's a lot of Bigfoot, reportedly. That makes sense. We have areas around here that have a lot of woods. Bigfoot kicked your ass. 
to outer space. He's called the Ohio Grass Man out here. Is he? Interesting. Apparently, they're just as big as, you know, like the normal Sasquatches, but their hair is longer. Huh. They're like really? a mix. They're like a mix between the skunk ape and the Sasquatch on the West Coast. Long hair like a skunk ape, but big and shaped like the ones over in around the West Coast area. Reported. Really? Yeah. Huh. Long, shaggy brown hair. How about that? The one down in Louisiana, if they call the skunk ape, it has webbed feet. Really? His feet are webbed. Interesting. Yeah. You gotta think. It lives in a swamp. It's definitely an interesting uh, thing to think of, something like that. Turns out that way would be standard Sasquatch, roughly. Yeah, the standard Sasquatch is mostly in the Pacific Northwest. Roughly uh, seven and a half feet, eight feet tall. Mm hmm. They must have huge ranges, though, to be able to, with the amount of food that they would need to consume. They're, they're reported related to being omnivores. Well, that would make sense, but they would still need fairly large a track to live on. Um, yeah, I mean, they're they're not what you would call, from what it's reported, they're not very territorial. Mm-hmm. Because they're not predators, per se. They're not known for hunting. They eat for most times when they're spotted, they're actually fishing. Oh yeah, that would make sense. I uh, I'm expecting uh, Harry to come watching in one day. They've, they've seen by rivers and streams catching fish, so makes some sense. They eat a lot of vegetation. Veg. Vegetation. Vegetation. Now the skunk ape, on the other hand, that one hunts. Mm. It's very violent. The Ohio grass man is... Never been a reported uh, attack, really, as far as I know. I see, I see. Hmm. There's been some interesting hoaxes, too. Yeah, there's people that do the hoaxes think, thinking they're going to get money for it. It's like, hey, you want to know it? I'm back. What's sorry, about, sorry it took so long. It happens. We're going to go to 12, 12.45, thanks to all the interruptions. All right. Okay. I mean, tomorrow's Sunday. It's not like... I don't think I'm going to church tomorrow. My mom's knee is in pretty bad shape. That's no good. They think she might have either torn or hyperextended her meniscus. Oh, that sounds painful. I don't think that's Aiden doing that. Yeah, no. Well, who was it? Casper the Friendly Ghost, Mark? No. It was, uh, 
I just hope they didn't open a rift to hell or something and put it under the pentagon. This isn't the crucible. I'm guessing the sh garage is out back. Let's go. Punch that shit. Do 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 do. Okay. So then Catch where, me outside. Where is the garage? I guess it must be over here. Hanya's in the chat. Hello, Hanya. Hanya. Sorry, there's been Dane's like. Not... Sorry, there's been like big 10, 15 minute breaks where I've been away. He is apparently up in New York. For those of you, whoa! For those of you wondering why that is, that's because my mother's back from the hospital, so um, I'm back to being her caretaker again. So you'll have to excuse those times when I have to get uh, get up and go away from the stream for a period of time. You can't she... blast loud music anymore. How's I... she doing? She's doing all right. She's a little ornery, but she's doing okay. Then again, you'd be ornery too if you just spent the last week hooked to tubes. Yes. Well, I hope she's so rested. So I don't, I don't falter for it. Not really. Apparently, she's like me. I hate hospitals, and so does she. Oh, I hate hospitals too. I hated being uh, in the hospital. The last time I went, I was with her pretty much the whole time, and I was like, man. But I can't go, I can't stay long term now because I got so much other things I got to deal with at the house, and of course these streams, I'd have to cancel streams for a week because I can't bring the equipment with me. No, no, not... N n now that you're using the computer, the laptop for less things... Yep. Back when you were just playing emulators or other things, sure that probably could have worked. But where's it at? It's in the it's in the cellar. Why is no, my code in the cellar? Well, not even that now because this laptop only has enough room. It only has a jack for headphones, so I'd have to bring my whole microphone set up. Oh, which I can't. I would, there wouldn't be any room for it. No. Uh. Plus, That's you know, right. I'm playing a lot more games on the PS4 now, so... Yes. Well, with that Elgato, it really helps. Yeah. Yeah, yeah now, that I'm, now that I'm playing the Elgato stuff through the Elgato, it's like, I, there's just no way I'd be able to bring all this shit. Nope. Not only that, but I need to be home for dartboard records, things like that. Mm-hmm. Alright. This reminds me of Indigo Prophecy in some ways. Actually, I believe the same guy who made this game did it. Indigo Prophecies. I'll check. Yeah, this was done by David Cage. Yes. Who did... Oh, sorry, he did Fahrenheit. Yes. Which was, uh, I think, a sequel to Indigo Prophecy? Yeah, Fahrenheit Indigo Prophecy, I think. He did Heavy Rain as well. Oh, yeah, yeah that he game did. is, uh, Jason. eventful. Jason! Jason! Yeah, oh, that Jason. game is, uh, His oh, next Jason. game. Jason! 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 His next game Jason. is actually going to be uh, Jason. Jason. Detroit be Become Human. Yeah, <clears throat> I did hear about that.
It's going to be interesting to see how long they keep the PlayStation around, PlayStation 4 around. <laughs> Mom will never know, despite the fact that she's fucking standing right there. Whoops. Steam sale till Monday? Okay. What's that about a steam sale? Uh, Hani said there's a steam sale until Monday. Hmm. Is there? Whoa! That's a hell of an armor, Jody. Should be a baseball player. Look at that snow physics when it hits you. Oh god. Doink. As long as you didn't hit him in the ear, and you hit him in the ear, game over. You ever get hit by a snowball in the ear? Yes, very much. The so. worst feeling on the planet. Let's see what storm sales going on. Single player. Ah, the Sims yeah. 3. Alright, dude, that's enough. Oops, he's being choked. I, I know the perfect game that my, we Mike can buy now. That's on sale on Steam. Car Mechanic Simulator 2018. Burn her! Burn her! Burn her! Oh, there's some interesting games on sale. Mass Effect's on sale. That's a good game that you would get content out of. Stories, huh? This must be like the first chapter. Yes. The woman actually likes you, but the guy Is doesn't. That, the guy can suck my labia. He'd have to go to jail. Yes. That's the point. I don't know. She has a spiritual force around her all the time. Uh, maybe they do. Like an uncontrollable animal, we have no idea what it's capable of. 
copy of a demon living with us right under our own roof. Susan, this is going to stop. And it's going to stop now. Before we end up crazy or dead. We agreed to look after a little girl, Susan, but not this. Not this. Okay. Press X to sleep. Or get attacked, one of the two. Okay, so all that's left is to call Aiden. Oh no, Five Nights at Freddy's. Doodly doodly do. I think that's the end of the chapter. It is. Let's see where we wind up next. Oh, apparently I could have eaten a cookie. Well, you should have ate the cookie. All right, next up, the condenser. My first real experience with the other sides. This is between the party and Welcome to the CIA. So this is early twenties. Uh, she's about seventeen here. That's a that's fairly early in the twenties. Okay, Willem. Mr. Defoe. If you're nasty. That's um, time to. <coughs> well, so you're at the age of a set now, huh? Mm. Doodle doodly do. Hence the title Beyond Souls. And my dick. Here's this. Suck on it. This will give you. This gives you your powers. Oh, oh it's salty because I had pizza last night. Oh. Did you put pineapple on it like I told you to do? No. All God. meat. The hell's wrong with you? Supper. <laughs> Fucking idiot. All right. I'm sorry. 
Jesus. Condensers in the lower basement. Oh. You need to find the control room. That's all they could tell me. <coughs> Johnny. The entities around the rift are not like I did. They're from the depths of the other side. They know them. So in other words, they're from hell? I don't think... No, they're not from hell. From what I understand, this other world is... Uh, is full, where... Uh, it's a parallel to our own world. It's not another dimension. Something like that, yeah. Let's go. I think they were trying to tap into power and other things and backfired. Looks like, like major. All right, so this is the lift. Have a good night, Ashley. Good night, Ashley. I mean, it's big red flashing warning letters. You obviously, the elevator's stuck. The, duh. See what you can do, Adam. Can do. On down the shaft. Uh huh. Wabushke. Wonder how many people died. Well, I don't know. Well, the elevator didn't come all the way up. Whoop, dead body. You can probably use the your uh, fellow to scan the body and learn what happened to him. I, I'd like to give you this. The guy wakes up and says, I'd like to give you this pamphlet about the watchtower. <laughs> <laughs> she pulls a gun out of nowhere. Uh, uh, Jehovah's Witness joke. Oh, I know what it was. We had one knocking at the door the other day. My dad <laughs> talked to them for 20 minutes and not once did they talk about God. Not once did they talk? No. Oh, I see. All right. Okay. Well. <laughs> God damn it. Harder than it looks. Very hard. Come on. Ah, fuck me. Come on, Schwartz. Come on, Schwartz. There we go. Got it. Hit. Hey. Oh! Shot me. That's how she died. Or he died. Yeah, you can probably do that to other people now that you've learned that ability. Probably. Wow, 
Well, today was free video game day. Oh? Oh, yes. I went and I got a uh, free video game. For the SNES. It was, they, they were giving them out in blind bags, so you had no idea what you were going to get. What did you get? I ended up getting Caesar's Palace. Is that good or bad? It was a free game. There. I mean, I normally wouldn't buy it because it's a casino game, but hey. All right, now that you're out of the way, uh, do 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 do. I guess I'll walk this way. Did you scan to see how he died? Nope. Not gonna either. Mm. Okay. Ah, I'm getting Resident Evil vibes. Oh shit. Now, I'd say obviously this door is probably locked. Pushing on X ain't gonna do any good. Oh god! The fuck? Hi, I'd like to talk about the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter day Saints. <laughs> Try to open it from the other side. Okay. Uh. Oh. Opened. Hey, buddy. Go through here. Excuse me. Well, Billy, I was right about the government doing stupid things, wasn't I? Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, it is the government. All right, I guess I'll have to use Iden to knock it over. Point. And a boink. How useful. Yep, very useful. Gotta flick the controller up to do that. You see my butt, everybody? You like my butt? <coughs> Remember, she's 17 here, Bill. Yeah, that's the age of consent. In some states. In Ohio, it is. Yes. In Ohio, it's actually 16, I believe. But yeah. So I'm real safe when I say this here. But there's some states where it's not 16. No, I think in one state it's 15. There's another... Oh. Okay. Cool. Lots of spooky shit. There's a dude. 
Okay. Uh... No. Bring it right there. That's perfect. Stop. Right there. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. There we go. Powerful concentration of energy, which allows us to open it. Broke his neck. <laughs> okay, so... Beyond him, fire in a in the hallways. Whoop. Cool music. Thanks, ghosts. Drop the chair, and away we go. There we go, perfect. Let's see how you died. Oh, look the same way. And you're dead. Lovely. Alright, well, we're going to see what happens next time on MVG Live. Thanks for joining us for this edition of uh, the show. For future events and updates, go to facebook.com slash MVG Live. And of course, um, metalstudios.net for past episodes. Catch the uh, Find the uh, cast of tonight's show on Twitter. I'm Metal CEO. Dane's Dana5611, Bill's Bill Carter 17, Mark's Mark T. Gledhill. Thanks for watching, and see you next time. Good night, everybody. Good night, Good night. everybody.